1 John 3.16 from the message says, This is how we come to understand and experience love. Christ sacrificed his life for us. This is what we ought to live sacrificially for our fellow believers, and not just be out for ourselves. If you see some brother or sister in need and have the means to do something about it, turn a cold shoulder and do nothing, what happens to God's love? This skit shows the return of the prodigal son and how our name is the meaning, and how our name is the meaning of what is happening in our life. Mom and 
and dad want me to, and you think you can just walk back into our lives anytime it's convenient for you? Well, you can. <coughs> I can't believe you. I'm sorry you feel that way, Beth, but I love and missed you so much. I thought about this moment so much and all the things I wanted to say to you. What is this, the repentance, sister? That's a new one. I wish you'd just insult me or say something like you used to. I'm learning this as I go here, Beth. I don't know that I can ever forgive you, Grace. <laughs> What's so funny? It just occurs to me for the first time what my name means and how much I want it come up. Then you say the word forgiveness and my name together. You just drop me. You should go hand in hand. Well, in this case, the damage may have already been done. And it's useless to try and repair it. I know. I know. Well, listen, I'm going to go find Dad. It won't be a bother to you. Promise me one thing. Don't give up on me. Grace. Yes? I don't get why you left. You just left me here. I thought freedom meant no rules. That freedom turned out to be one great-looking prison. Grace. Yeah? <laughs>